Hi everyone, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out a lot. So hit that subscribe button. Today we're going to be making some gold and white resin coasters inspired by gold marble. So let's jump in and get started. I went ahead and mixed up my resin off camera. Today I'm using the Total Boat High Performance Epoxy. And I did fill my molds up halfway with clear resin. Now I'm just going in with some gold and just drawing on some lines. And you can see if I start my line of gold outside of the mold, I don't get that big blob of pigment dropping down inside my mold. See that on these two on the left, I kind of got those like tadpole looking lines. If you start your line outside of your mold, you won't get those, but no worries. Um, I'm going to go in with a toothpick and fix those. So it'll be, it'll be fine in the end. Now we're going to go in with some white. This is actually ocean white from Let's Resin. It's a new pigment that they have. It's a really awesome, super easy to use opaque white. Uh, highly recommend it if you're looking for a nice opaque white. I'll link it down below. And I only wanted to add a few lines of this to each of my molds. White will take over if you add a whole bunch, so I only wanted to add a few lines of white to each of these. I'm going in with a toothpick and very carefully just working on the surface of the resin and kind of smoothing out any of those little blobs. I wasn't pushing down to the bottom of the mold. You want to be really careful. You don't want to scratch your mold. I was only working on the surface of the resin and that was it. I didn't add any heat to it. Let it cure overnight. This is the next day. We're going to fill up the mold the rest of the way or the molds the rest of the way. This is some gold glitter mixed with clear resin and same um, ocean white from Let's Resin mixed with clear. Just poured the glitter on the left and the right of each of the molds and then hit the middle with that white to fill the mold up the rest of the way. Super Super easy technique. You can get real creative with this technique as well and use any colors you want. Um, I've done quite a few videos on my channel previously where on this second layer I use all glitter, um, a bunch of different colors of glitter. So if you haven't seen those videos, definitely go check them out. I'll link them down below. I hit this with my heat gun to pop bubbles, let it cure overnight, and here we are ready to take them out of the mold. I was really excited to see how these turned out. Super pretty. I'm going to get them in some better lighting so you can really see that gorgeous gold. It's um, Mayron gold. You can get it off Amazon. It has like a floating effect, so it's really, really gorgeous. And I did mix up my resin off camera. Um, I used the Total Boat High Performance Epoxy on this, on these. It's great for projects like this. But if you're new to resin and you want to see a tutorial showing step by step how I mix my resin, I'll link one of my tutorials down below in the description box. Um, be sure to go check it out. I usually cut the mixing out of my videos because I have a few dedicated tutorials showing step by step how I mix my resin. So I just refer people to those videos if you want to see how I mix my resin and my pigments. But let me know what you guys think of these. I absolutely love how they turned out. So fun and so easy to do. I hope you give this technique a try. Let me know if you guys have any questions down in the comments. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Naptime Creations, and go check out a few more of my other videos. That would really help me out a lot. Helps out my channel if you watch a few of my videos back to back. I hope you guys are all doing fantastic, and I will see you soon for another video. Bye, guys.